Right, so today's video is sort of a two-parter. First of all, you have Colin and Samir doing another weekend film festival. Challenge for all of you. Now, given the fact that we're all staying at home right now and we can't go outside, our prompt this week is called the Camera Roll Challenge. So what we want you guys to do is pull a photo or video from your camera roll on your phone and tell us the story behind it. So I want to try and do that, but it's kind of dependent on a location uh, and with the current lockdown it's may not be accessible so to go and see if I can get in just to film something quickly there and secondly I want to try and do something on the audio on this I'm not sure if there's something I can be doing differently in terms of either post-production or something in camera or maybe it's just me my voice and talking which would be interesting because if it is that that's something you don't see online you can tons of videos on internally improving the audio or in post-production but if it's to do with the expression and enunciation of words it's something you don't see a lot of youtubers discussing so it'd be interesting to see if it's that on to part one yes yeah, so unfortunately that didn't work uh, the road that I wanted to go to was blocked off because of the current quarantine and um, into pedestrian road as well so I could probably walk there or cycle there uh, which brings me to option B Bye. So I think I'm going to have to scrap this idea for today and I'll try and do it tomorrow because one or two things with the bike. It's been out for a bit too long, chains are rusted and the tires are flat. So this needs a serious wash and the tires need to be pumped. I think the gears and everything are going to be okay um, but I can't find my pump so I'm going to go to a garage to get it pumped it's a bit it's starting to get late now I don't want to be doing it so I'm going to skip the weekend film fast video for today I'll wash the bike chains now at least get them done overnight um, and then I'll try and pick it up tomorrow so I guess we'll move on to part two of today's video. Audio. I think Oscar's room's where the best one to do our audio tests. But, uh, I'm gonna clean up the Paw Patrol first. So, give us a second. This is the first audio test. I'm currently using the Rode Video Micro on top of the camera. So we'll see how it compares to the other options I have. So testing, testing, one, two, three. Video Micro audio test. So as you can tell from my last clip, when I took the video micro out of the camera, it cut off all the audio. So I was using the same clip. So the video was the same with the audio cut out because I took out the audio of the camera. 
so you couldn't even see hear me talking about it how it was on the camera and then I went on to start talking about the lavalier mic uh, which in itself didn't work and I was putting it in I think the, the lavalier I have designed for a sort of a wireless mic kit and it has a screw on it to screw into the, the receiver and I think that was blocking it from going into the camera fully and I wasn't getting a proper read on it you'd pick up noise every time you hit the end of it or the wire hit off the tripod but I wasn't picking up any of my dialogue so I'm going to try compare it to just the camera again obviously in a separate clip now uh, I tried also to look at any of the settings doesn't seem to be anything there other than just to overall sort of doing a master adjustment to the levels which may need to be doing it because I think I, I'm just about pushing the minus 12 dB so that might be something I can try and improve so I'm going to try to do a few more tests so this has been me talking with the video micro with no changes to the camera so I'm going to try a new clip same again, except without the microphone. So now, this is me talking using just the inbuilt microphone on the camera. It's a Panasonic G9. Uh, I'm not sure how good it is. Again, I can see by the levels on the screen, it's pushing the 12 dB. It's not as bad as with the micro. So I think it's definitely picking up more. And as a result, it's pushing over the DB. So I'm going to try again. Because I'm going to try to adjust the levels a bit to see if that changes anything. So now this is the onboard microphone. Except I've adjusted the mic down minus 6 DB. So I'm hoping it shouldn't be pushing it over uh, the line you want with the DB minus 12 DB. So I'm hoping that's a bit better. Again, I'm not entirely sure, but I'm going to try it now with the video micro. So now, this is the video micro at minus 6 dB. I can see by the levels, it's slightly lower. It's not, last time, it was going over minus 12 dB, or under, I'm not sure which way it goes. But at the levels are starting here. It's going out and it's going past minus 12. Now it's not. So I'm hoping that's going to be a bit of an improvement. But I'll check back with you in a minute and we'll see. So minus 6 didn't work. It went too low and you couldn't really hear me properly, as you can guess. Uh, so I've moved it back to minus 3 now using the video micro. I think I'm not going to keep doing this all night so. I think that's going to be enough for it. I think the main thing is sort of the presentation of my voice. Um, I, I can get a different mic, I can get one that's more of a shotgun mic that will pick me up. That's fine, but what it mostly do is disregard any outside noises. Which is what I want to get it eventually, but I think for now that's not going to make a massive difference. Again, I can make adjustments in camera, or I can try and do something in post. But again, it's more sound design for like all audio, rather than just my voice. So again, it's not going to do too much. I think the main thing that needs work is more the projection of the voice. Um, and keeping the levels up. Cutting out the M's every second. We'll work on it. But I think I'm going to leave it there for tonight. Hope you enjoyed this video. Enjoy watching me try and test these things. And hopefully tomorrow I will get a better shot at the weekend film festival. So keep tuned to see how that turns out. Alright, good night. Say hi.
Okay. Hey. <laughs> come here. Okay. Sonia. Now, say bye. Bye. Love you.